good evening friends and uh, this is yet another session on form work in this uh, session we are going to see some site photographs and for, with that photographs we will understand what are the different terms used what are the different words used or different concepts related to form work so are you ready and i hope that you have already subscribed to my channel and you have already pressed the bell shaped button so that you get quick notifications so you are subscribed fantastic so let us start in previous uh, uh, video i think uh, you must remember now these four words centering shuttering staging scaffolding so we will start with scaffolding so what is scaffolding we said scaffolding is the arrangement made for the people it could be you it could be any other person it could be a fitter it could be a mason it could be a plumber it could be a painter anybody who has got a work on the on the building he, he can stand on it he can sit on it he can work on it so it has to be a strong scaffolding okay the word is scaffolding in uh, western countries they usually call it scaffold when i was in uk what i saw that whenever the new work uh, or whenever the renovation work of a of an existing building starts the first thing they do is to construct a scaffold all around the building so that it gives you a working platform a safe working platform okay now second we come to the famous word centering look horizontal surface supporting the slab is centering these are all centering plates these are the joints between plates and this thing is called gabadi this is the indian word hindi word this is called gabadi gabadi means to make up for the gap because the centering plates are having fixed dimensions so usually the centering plates are made of 600 mm by 900 mm or 2 feet by 9 uh, 2 feet by 3 feet 600 mm by 900 mm remember standard plate size is 600 by 900 mm so naturally if the room is not in multiples of either 600 or 900 what will happen a gap like this will come so this gap is then closed with wooden battens and then it is called gabri this is the beam okay and this is the beam bottom these are the beam sides beam sides this is the slab another slab what are you going to see here this is the staircase this type of shuttering is called hanging shuttering because why it is called hanging because these planks are not actually supported on anything they are not supported at the bottom they are only supported from the sides so it is called hanging shuttering uh, if you have, if you want to know how this staircase is cast there is a, one of my videos is available which is on casting of rcc staircase it is a very popular video you can see that okay then see the small pieces of wood irregularly cut pieces of wood is called lafa lafa is used for uh, miscellaneous purposes different purposes uh, here you are seeing all the wooden planks are laterally braced with bamboo third now let us see what is this happening rcc column for rcc column the sides or the shuttering is being made by the carpenters with plywood this is plywood and these are the runners about this plywood we spoke that this should 
the uh, the thickness should be minimum 12 mm it should be marine ply it should be waterproof ply and the weight should not be less than 34 kg per square meter this is the form work for the column which is ready in position you can see the sides of the columns this thing is called shikanja this is a uh, iron ms iron clamp through which we hold the sides together and this is a this is called as clamp this is a different type of shikanja shikanja you can see here and this is a clamp so this is hot rolled sections two angles face to face two angles face to face on either side and fixed together with tie rods this is the column from the side view shikanja shikanja and you can see the plumb bob being fixed there is one video which shows how the uh, plumb is checked on a column before casting you can see that video yet another view of the form work for column this is shikanja this is shikanja and this is chabi this is chabi so any square section in wood square or rectangular 3 by 3 4 by 4 to end up by 3 this type of wooden section is called chabi this is a shuttering for rcc lift wall this is our plywood runners these are and this is balli balli munda or vasa a circular section of wood is called balli munda or vasa you can call it as a wooden prop it is the same thing this is a span the spans could be of two types one is called fixed span one is called adjustable span these are used for staging these are also called as acro spans acro spans here you can see the span is actually being used this is the span this is the prop steel prop here steel prop here the steel props are supporting a chabi and on the top of chabi you can see the prop on the top of prop you can see the centering plates the centering can be done two different styles one is with centering plates or by using plywood if you use plywood the finish will be better but cost will also be more than the centering plates so you have to decide this is another picture column ready column is ready from this column you fix the beam bottom this is span this is span steel prop wooden balli wooden balli okay this is staging staging for the industrial building rcc column rcc column beams and this staging is still here now how the gaps between the centering plates can be closed so there are six different ways one is you can use a putti you can use the putti you can use mild steel strips you can use waterproof paper or you can use brown masking tape now often people ask me what is a masking tape so you must have used this tape for packing the cardboard or cartons boxes have you used this for packing there is an usually brown tape 1 uh, inch 1 and 1/2 inches then what you do just 
cover it the box right so this is called uh, masking tape then some people use newspaper old newspapers make small holes and fix it in the gap then sixth is cow dung plus yellow soil mix it together put it in a gamela or patty and let one person fill it fill all the gaps with hand okay this is these are called h frames this is a better way of uh, staging or scaffolding both can be done with this look this is one frame h shape frame another h shape frame and they are uh, fixed together they are kept together with the help of these bracings so you can keep on adding look this is span 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 here i have given what are the different sizes of the centering plates the most common size is 600 by 900 mm another size is 600 by 1200 mm another size is 300 by 900 mm yet another size is 300 by 1200 mm so if uh, in normal normally people use 600 by 900 mm this is widely used now here you see a different uh, variation of the steel props they are the steel props with jacks so jacks help you to fine tune at the top this is yet another uh, advanced system of form work this is called cup lock system what is cup lock system two uh, frames kept on the top of each other multiple frames are kept so this is one frame the lower frame this is top frame so top frame is kept on the bottom frame the locking is done like this see this is the bottom frame the top leg is kept in this lower frame and then this is rotated so that it gets locked it also has got this uh, beautiful locking system that's why it is called cup lock system this kind of arrangement can have wheels which are called uh, castor wheels these are usually teflon coated so that the wear and tear is smooth this is same cup lock system in actual use at one of the projects where i had visited this is a photograph I had taken where the, this type of chrome uh, work was used. This is a conventional method. You can see centering plates, centering plates. This is gabadi, balli, balli, lafa, lafa. You have to know all these words. This is a jack, as we said earlier. These are the edge frames used for centering of the slab. See, this is the jack. This type of arrangement is called double staging. When the height of the roof is more, suppose the height of the roof is say 6 meters, 7 meters. Then you, if you fix a single bully of 6 meters, it will become weak because of slenderness. If you have got a steel pipe for 6 meters, it will be slender, its strength will be less. Therefore, what we do, we first construct a platform at mid level, a total platform and then we start building the form work from top of the platform. You can see it in this picture. See, this is the stage 1, first platform has been made and then again further props have started from here same double staging we can have double staging we can have triple staging depending on the height see this is double stage and outside outside the plinth it has come to triple stage 